Hello, this is the first of a series of videos on putting together the Automobox car. Before you start assembling any of your parts, please make sure that your Automoblox project is the current project and make sure that you've downloaded all of your parts into the folder associated with that project. Assuming that that's complete, begin a new assembly. And in that assembly, you're going to be making the wheel assembly first. So this is going to end up being a sub-assembly. So we go to place and in this assembly we will throw in one wheel and if I hold down control I can grab a few things. One tire and one axle. Go ahead and hit open and uh, just click to place those and then hit escape so that you're not placing more of them and the three of them should be in there. There you go. All right, we're going to use a new type of assembly constraint um, to put these guys together. So we're going to go to constrain and the type of constraint we're going to use is this one here. It's called insert. So use the insert constraint and then the trick to using this correctly is to grab the edges that you want to have stuck together. So if I grab this edge here and then I grab this edge here those two edges are stuck together. However, if you look at it, they're kind of oriented backwards and that's pretty easy to figure out. Just click on the other solution. So if it shows up like this, just go to in the solution section of place constraints, choose the other one and it should flip it around to the right direction. Go ahead and hit apply. Now, if we take a quick peek at the um, tire and wheel, so far you'll notice that there's a clear back and a front to it and so the axle needs to go into the back. All right if you look at the axle there is uh, a part of the axle that has these little sort of uh, um, bumps on it. Um, you can see it a little bit better here maybe. Um, that part goes into the wooden um, body of the car. All right so we don't want to put that into the wheel. Um, what we're going to do is, let me just get rid of this for a moment so I can move some stuff around. What we want to do is we want to put the part of the axle that has the slot into this opening here. So I'll go to constrain. I'm going to use the insert constraint once again and choose the two edges that the insert constraint will have kind of connect together. And the trick with the insert constraint is that it is going to align the axis that is the center of these guys. All right, so it works with circular things and it aligns their central axis and then it places the two edges together. So let's see if it did what we wanted it to. Flip it around here and it looks like we're good. So it chose this solution. Let's see what would have happened with the other one. And uh, that would not have been so good. We'd have all this interfering material. All right, so if things aren't going right in terms of it being oriented correctly, just choose the other solution. That's all you need to do for the wheel assembly. All right, so those guys are all together there. Um, go ahead and hit File, Save As, and save it as Wheel Subassembly. And of course, I've already got one, but that should work for you.